Before the 2020 season starts in earnest, there are a few jobs we need to attend to before we can tow. Getting the new van ready for towing, bit of a DIY project, a little bit dark, but there's a DIY reversing camera. This is what it looks like when it's better exposed. I need to replace the bulbs behind the heating controls. You can't see them when it's dark. So I have opened up the panel, removed the two holes, and there are the two bulbs which are blown. I'll now replace them. Yeah, it's kind of hard to see. But the heater lights are now working. The old hazard warning light switch has seen better days. I've taken the opportunity to fix a new one when I had the um, gearbox cowling thing off. And the wire that comes from the 12 volt socket has been routed up in a natural channel into this handy little box that we've got that's got multiple USB ports and uh, 12 volt outlets. Another addition. Yep, that's going to do the job. Looks perfect. Now, of course, you're going to need one of these things. And I've polished it up properly, so we're not going to interfere with the operation of the Alco hitch. I'm also going to fix up the damage caused by a trip into South Wales. It was an excellent CL. Uh, totally worth it. Screws are looking a bit worse for wear. Let me see if I've got any spares resembling that. And there's the spare part kit. The cover itself was only 65p. And the two plastic covers were 55p a piece. Not really a bargain. And I've also decided to pop in a little bit of marine sealant to make sure the job is properly weather sealed. Here's what the end cap looks like when it's fitted. Unfortunately, the footage of the installation was lost. Part of the BE test is to check that you have the correct number plate on the trailer or caravan that you're towing. This one is no longer correct. Right, let's pull off the old number plate. really stuck down really hard there you go just pull it off gently right, that's the end of that you don't get to clean behind the number plate that often, so we're taking the golden opportunity of doing just that. Stick on a bit of tape, put the new plate in its rightful place. And the grand unveiling. Unveil it. There we go, there's our number plate and some may find it slightly unfortunate, but hey ho. Thanks for watching. 
Remember to follow us on social media. Subscribe to our channel. Give us a like. And turn on notifications. Bye. Bye.